Hello everyone, welcome to this video. Uh, in this video, I will talk about how to run HTML in Jupyter Notebook. The first methods we can run HTML directly in Markdown cell. For example, we want to uh, print uh, H1 tag, uh, the head one tag. We use HTML had one tux, tux, then we put the text yeah between the tux yeah this is a head one let's right yeah this is the result the second example is we make a link yeah for example to the Jupyter Notebook project website we use a tux, then the hypertext reference. We put the URL here, then we write the text like Jupyter Notebook. We write, yeah, this is the link to the Jupyter Notebook web. Let's click, then you know, we, we come to the website. Another example is we use HTML image tag to embed an image. For example, we use image, then the source, we put the path of the image you want to embed into the markdown cell. In this example I'm embed a uh, uh, Jupyter logo into the markdown cell. Yeah this is the logo of Jupyter notebook. Another example is we join a table use HTML syntax in markdown cell we make a, a three rule three rules three columns table this is the table header tax the table date tax table rule this is table rule Let's write. Yeah, this is the table. The second method is to use a magical command uh, to run HTML. We use the percent percent HTML uh, cell magic command. Yeah, we put this magic command at the beginning of the uh, of a cell and followed by the HTML code like the header one. Example we write yeah this is a result. The second example is the link but maybe you have seen that html yeah here we use the locus yeah both locus and uppercase works yeah for, for the cell magic the example of image embedding yeah first we write the uh, Command the magic magics, then followed by the syntax. This is the table example. Yeah, is the same. We write the the magic at the beginning of the cell. Then we put the 
the HTML codes. Yeah. We write. Yeah, it's because it's large, we can make it smaller. Then we see the table. Yeah, the table is here. The third method is run HTML, use the IPython HTML module. First, we import HTML module like this from IPython dot core dot display import HTML then we use the function HTML we put the HTML syntax as a string yeah put it into a, a double quotation mark or single uh, quotation mark that's right yeah this is the result so it is the uh, the same is the uh, li links yeah we put just the put the this HTML syntax in the quotation mark This is the example of image embedding. Yeah, we put the HTML code in the quotation mark, then use HTML function. Oh, this is the table. But here we use uh, uh, something different because the code is long. Yeah, for the long syntax code, we give a variable name like this. For example, here my HTML table. Yeah, the short form my H table. Then we put the code the long code between a triple quotation mark uh, either single quotation or double yeah here's I use double this is the the table uh, HTML code we write first then we um, use HTML function and just um, my HTML as the augment then we write yeah this is the render or outcome this method is good because uh, you know for longer uh, syntax yeah we use this uh, and also, we can put the uh, results anywhere in the notebook. And it, you know, for the first methods and uh, the second and the third methods, um, the difference I mean between them is uh, that the the first one is run HTML in markdown cell but the third and the second ones uh, in fact is uh, 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 running HTML in code cell uh, thank you for watching this video uh, if you have any uh, questions please leave me a message I hope to uh, see you in other videos. Thank you.